What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be going over some pretty insane news for The Flash Season 9. And also at the end of the video, I'll be breaking down The Flash's Season 9 Episode 3 trailer. Um, but yeah, with that, all that being said, let's get right into this. So yes, guys, you are reading the title correctly. Zoom has officially been confirmed to return in The Flash Season 9. And with Zoom's return, the actor who played Zoom, uh, Teddy Sears, who also obviously was uh, Hunter Zolomon, has also been confirmed to return, which is really exciting because they literally just could have said that, you know, they just could have had some guy in the, the Zoom suit and said that Zoom returned because obviously it, the mask covers up his face, so you can't really tell that it's that it's Teddy Sears playing Zoom. Um, so I think it's really cool that Teddy Sears is going to be uh, returning because, yeah, we haven't seen him since season five so that'll be great um now i am going to read you guys a little bit of what eric wallace had to say about zoom's return from an article from tv line i'll leave the article in the description if you guys want to read the rest of it um so the article reads previewing sears encore the flash showrunner eric wallace says as one of our most memorable villains ever he scared and delighted audiences in season two and now i'm happy to announce that the brilliant teddy sears is coming back as the evil zoom aka hunter zolomon for one more battle against team flash it's a reunion i've been hoping could happen for several Several seasons and now I'm so excited that we're finally able to bring Teddy and incredible talents back into our Flash family for our epic and emotional ninth season so get ready to be frightened again Flash fans so that's yeah that's absolutely amazing to hear that you know uh, Teddy Sears will be returning um, also this article breaks down John Wesley ship returning as Jay Garrick but that was confirmed like a month ago from the actor himself that Jay Garrick would be returning um, so yeah zoom returning is going to be absolutely awesome now, guys, with that said, how exactly could Zoom return? Like, obviously, he turned into the Black Flash last time we saw him. So how exactly could he return? Now, I think, you know, the main theory here is that Crisis on Infinite Earths changed a lot of things, and that could include Zoom's timeline, because obviously, you know, Team Flash has mentioned Zoom since Crisis on Infinite Earths, so you'd have to assume that Zoom would be from Earth Prime in this new timeline. Um, obviously, in the previous timeline, he was from Earth 2, so that's really interesting right there. So what I think could happen is they could just say that Zoom never died. He was simply just like, you know, put in Argus or something like that, and he's been alive this whole time. I think that definitely makes sense. If they're going to say that Zoom returns because of time travel, I think that would be the dumbest thing ever. I mean, it's the final season. You might as well just, like, you know, have him return and actually have it be him in the present. I think that would be amazing. Um, so, yeah, I think that's the main theory I have right now. Now, I had another theory about how Zoom could return in the past, but I don't think that's going to happen anymore. And that would be um, the Earth Prime, or at the time, Earth 1 Hunter Zolomon becoming Zoom. If you guys remember in the Flash Season 2, Earth 2 Hunter Zolomon, aka Zoom, uh, showed Caitlyn that he has an Earth 1 doppelganger that, you know, wasn't evil and was just some normal guy. So my theory was that, that he would become Zoom somehow. Um, but yeah, I don't think that's going to happen anymore just because, you know, it's the Flash's final season. They got to bring back our Hunter Zolomon. And I think that if they brought him back using the, you know, crisis as a way to reset things, saying Zoom was just an Argus this entire time, I think that would definitely make a lot of sense. So with Zoom returning, another speedster character that I'd really like to see return is that of Godspeed. Obviously, uh, they didn't really do him justice in Season 7. He wasn't very good. Um, so I think if they had him return as well, that would be awesome. What I would love to see happen um, would be if Zoom is an Argus and Godspeed, obviously, we know he is an Argus. So I think if, you know, both of them were an Argus and then they, like, teamed up and escaped and then destroyed Central City, just like that newspaper said, I think that would be really cool to see. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, even if Godspeed doesn't, turn, doesn't return, Z still seeing Zoom in Season 9 is is going to be absolutely amazing. So yeah, guys, that was about it for the Zoom stuff. Now let's go ahead and break down the Season 9, Episode 3 trailer. Um, so it starts off with Barry and Hartley getting guns pointed at them, and this is going to be where I'm assuming they get into that uh, Goldface black market operation once again um, to, you know, find Goldface to recruit him. Um, and it looks like Hartley's going to be, like, more of a regular in this Red Death storyline, which, I mean, he's an alright character, I guess. Um, so yeah, I think that, you know, this episode doesn't look too interesting. We got, you know, obviously the returning rogues we have, or ex rogues I should say um, we have the hotness right here who's you know more than ready to get started working with Barry um, and then we have this new meta right here or rogue I should say not necessarily a meta um, but I don't know what she I don't know what she is or he maybe he is a guy with long hair who knows I don't know what this character is gonna be I don't know who this is I, don't, I can't think of anyone that this could be so it's gonna be really interesting to see who this is if you guys have any theories on that I'm sure some of you guys probably have an idea of who this is um, but yeah and also it's looking like Mark or, you know, Chill Blaine is like 
I don't know if he's necessarily turning on Barry, but he just, like, he is angry. You can tell he's angry. So I think that if he were to become more of a rogue, that'd be pretty cool. And surprisingly, it seems like also toward the end of the trailer that Goldface and Hartley are looking like they might turn on Barry at, at least, you know, at the start of this scene. Um, I'm assuming it'll all work out eventually. But yeah, I think that was pretty interesting right there. And obviously we know that in this episode, the the rogues are going to be helping Red Death build a time machine, which is going to be really interesting to see. I really hope this episode isn't like a ton of what we see in this trailer. I hope it's a lot of Red Death stuff too, because from the trailer, it really doesn't look too interesting. So yeah, I guess we're just going to have to wait and find out. But anyways, I'd say that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure to comment your thoughts on this video down below, as well as your thoughts on all this stuff. What do you guys think about Zoom returning? I think that's crazy. Uh, comment your thoughts on the trailer, all that stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next video.